Green onions are actually immature onions uh, which are harvested before the bulbs mature. They have a green stalk which is also called scallion. If you leave them in the ground for a long time, the bulbs will grow bigger and they will become regular onions. So there are two ways of uh, um, uh, growing green onions. One is from seeds and the other is uh, using the um, roots of uh, the already existing green onion. For example, here we have these green onions. I have cut off the roots about one inch or three quarters of an inch and that's what we are going to plant in the soil. So you have used up your uh, green onions that you bought from store and uh, you have cut out the roots and this is what is remaining. Uh, now uh, you know normally you just throw this away but you know if you want uh, some green onions a, a continuous supply of green onions in your garden uh, you just uh, plant these and they'll grow and you can use the greens uh, from these plants. So this is what normally I do. Whatever um, uh, green onions I use, I cut a little bit more at the bottom. So, you know, I uh, discard about uh, three quarters of an inch of each of the stalk. And then I just plant them and in a few days they'll start to grow and uh, then i just keep pruning the greens from the top and keep using it in my cooking so i have a continuous supply of green onions so here in this planter i have a good potting soil mix it has a lot of compost and a little bit of perlite um, so compost is for uh, nutrition and perlite is for good drainage so I'm just going to take uh, each of these one by one and just make a hole and just plant it and cover it fully. And you don't have to place them too far apart uh, because you can see that the bulbs are really, really tiny. If you leave them for a long time there, then maybe the bulbs will grow bigger and then you can use them as regular onion, but I just place them pretty close to each other. Now I'm just going to water them and uh, I leave them outside uh, in partial sun and uh, we'll go from there. It's been only one week and you can see that uh, our onion bulbs have started to grow. So they are in uh, partial sun, so they get about, uh, you know, two hours of direct sunlight and then mostly shade. So two more weeks have passed and you can see that uh, some of them are like three to four inches tall and some of them are a couple of inches tall. So when you're growing a uh, green onion, just make sure that the soil is... Uh, a little bit moist all the time not too dry because it has a lot of leaves and they are kind of hollow so you need to keep them moist in general green onions like full sun but i noticed that when i put them in full sun uh, they don't do that well the leaves start to turn yellow so i have moved them, i have kept them in partial sun only so now these onion plants are about 10 to 12 inches uh, tall and we can harvest them so I can cut you know these big uh, leaves and you will see that within a few days uh, they'll grow back again so that's how you know I keep using the same green onion plants forever you know i'll keep chopping uh, the leaves so obviously i don't uh, pull out the whole uh, onion because then you'll have to again plant it i just use the greens of these but then you know i always have a supply of uh, green part of the onions at home so now i've chopped a few of these and i'll use it in my cooking and I'll show you 
that uh, in a few weeks this will regrow so you can just keep on pruning and using it it's been a couple of weeks that we uh, pruned our uh, green onions and if you look at these plants so here is where we pruned and look at this another shoot has come out and it has grown tall similarly here we pruned it and this has become so tall in all of them wherever we have pruned them new leaves have come out and they have started growing like here we pruned and look at this it has grown so it is as simple as that just uh, plant your uh, you know the rooted side of the uh, green onions which you normally throw away in the soil and within few weeks they'll start to grow and then you have an evergreen supply of uh, the greens of the green onions so this is a great project for kids uh, because they enjoy this this grows so fast and you know just from your kitchen scraps you are able to grow something that's really exciting so i hope this video was useful to you if you have any questions leave a comment and i'll try to answer as soon as possible if you like this video press the like button and subscribe to our channel and i'll see you next time happy gardening bye